A 17-year-old girl recovering in the hospital tonight after being hit by a car in Pearl City. It happened Tuesday night on Waimano Home Road less than two weeks before her high school graduation. Sarah Madison spoke to the family in the hospital. Sarah. Howard and Bridget, the victim's parents, say the daughter, their daughter, Victoria, was coming home from school when she was struck in a marked crosswalk. Police say a vehicle stopped for the victim when another car tried to go around. That driver ended up hitting Victoria. They didn't know what happened until they received a dreadful call from the hospital. Let's face it, she's still my daughter, but she won't be the same. It's a parent's worst nightmare. Jerry Arellano received a call from the hospital that shook him to the core. There's no word to express how you feel. I mean, it's just numb. You can't. It, I, I couldn't even walk. I couldn't even get out of the car. Arellano says Victoria is still in critical condition, but she's been responsive. I told her, if you can please squeeze my hand by saying I love you to me. Yes, she did. And it's so tight. And it's so tight. Yesterday, the orthopedic basically put her together, all our broken bones, all the fractures. Before the crash, Victoria was preparing for graduation from Waipahu High School next Thursday. She was bound for the University of Hawaii this fall to become a teacher. Now everything is put on hold. The uncertainty of the future has left the family heartbroken and their lives changed forever. She's been robbed of that opportunity to be part of her graduating class and be there physically. Uh, you know, that's one chapter of her life that's been robbed. The Arellanos have always taught their children to use the crosswalk and to be careful. Now they're pleading to drivers. Every time we see a crosswalk, whether there's a people or not, please. Slow down because we never know if the one that we get hurt is one of our family members. This is just happening too much here in Hawaii. You know, every month we got somebody that's being run over. 15 seconds, 20 seconds to stop for a pedestrian to cross, it's not going to hurt you. Now, the family says the principal of Waipahu High may deliver Victoria's diploma to her in the hospital. Police tell us the driver involved has not been arrested and the charges will depend on the outcome of the investigation. Back to you.